Hey, this is Evil Dev Fan 102. Back with the next part of Toy Fan Seven, Part Seven, and now we're gonna go back to Zelwyn City. Zelwyn City, and we're gonna go to the pub area because there's an event. Welcome. Oh, it's you. I've been hearing some interesting rumors about you. It seems you're earning quite a reputation. In this establishment, we host requests for skilled adventurers. I would love, I would love it if you accepted one of them. If you like. Would you accept this request? You can complete it when you have some spare time. I'll just be waiting here. And this is pretty, pretty much um, quest. About quest, you can chat with customers at the pub. Um, blah blah blah. Might know some useful information, so it could be worth while to talk to him. Gullimo can arrange work for you under accept qu um, quest. Available jobs will be listed. So just choose one and press X to register it. Once you complete the quest, no, the quest, return to the pub and report the report it. Simply select report quest and choose the quest you wish to report. Yeah, it's kind of obvious, that, I mean, it's not that hard to figure out. Um, quests of assigned ranks that reflect your competency as a fencer. So pretty much what I'll, I'll explain to, uh, myself is just like Hyper, quests are done throughout ranks and to, there is a trophy to do with an S rank. Or is it an A rank? No, it, no, there is an S rank. Yeah, there's an S rank. So, yeah, I will be doing all the quests in the game. <coughs> and in fact, it is possible to do every quest in the game because I've actually done it. Um, on my death walkthroughs, run of the game I was doing, I actually did every quest. Now, there are quests which are really, really, really tedious and really annoying, which are going to be so interestingly boring to watch. I might have to cut ahead with some of that because it's it's all about chance and I just don't feel like people want to watch like an hour of maybe of maybes. Uh, but we'll, we'll get to that. we'll get to that when we get to that. As for now, there are a bunch of quests here. Um, I'm not going to focus on quests just yet because this is this part is just going to be the place in general but the next part in part 8 will be focusing on doing a few quests before I do the next dungeon so yeah basically this part will be just finishing off Zelwins itself and then it'll be quest time so anyway let's go to the Sunflower Inn we have an event we have an event or should I say it turns to the next day <laughs> it turns to the next day and then there's nice bird, bird sounds Cheap, cheap. Says. Why'd you wake me up? I was sleeping so peacefully. Seriously, what are you gonna do if my skin dries out? A lady needs her beauty sleep, you know. With a face like that, I think a minor skin condition is the least of your worries. Decent person should already be awake and working at this hour. Now then, please hurry and finish your preparations. We shall be leaving soon. Leaving where? Hey, wait a minute! Why are you giving us orders? You do understand who you should be thanking for arranging your lodgings for the night, correct? I already know that! Gosh, you're even more pompous today than you were yesterday! I thought about my actions last night. And I realized that, as your master, I should be much stricter for both your sins. More stricter? <laughs> That's not, um, needed. Are you kidding me? There's no way I'd ever <coughs> deal with my master. Hey, Fang, why are you being so quiet? Say something! He doesn't want to get involved in this stupid talking. <laughs> I'm freaking sleepy. So, if there are no oh. further objections, I shall leave the preparations to Aaron. Jeez. Jeez. That's all she says. Jeez. Okay, so. First of all, let's go and do some godly revival. We'll do it in like order of going down. The order of going down. So, let's do some godly revival first. Okay, so what can we pull out? 
What sword can we pull out today? Um, okay, we've got. Yeah, we've got two more to do. So we've got PXS 04G, which was the one that we got from. I think it was. Yeah, it was the one that we got from beating the boss. And you have to go and lab the kids. Okay, this should be a very a quite an easy one. Oh wait, ooh, this this guy might take a bit of... Yeah, sometimes you get um, quite hard ones of these. Obviously this is not going to be hard forever. Um, like later on, this this kind of battle is very easy. Although you're very easy in general. Okay, let's take out you. Ooh. Let's take out you. No, still alive. This guy doesn't want to die. This guy doesn't want to. Oh, wait, I killed him. Bye bye. Yay! 34 XP. That wasn't too bad. Successful. And then another sword gets to be pulled out. Of her arm. Sword is coming out. Oh, we see some of her arm. She successfully pulled out a Fury Seal and the Fairy within it has been obtained for new power. That is a PXS04G. Okay. Okay, so where's the other one? What can be... Um, where can I pull out the other one? No. 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 Somewhere. Oh wait, here, here we go. This is Seal, which I believe was for that um, side boss that we just did in the last part. Okay, what level are these? Level 5. Oh crap. Paralyze. Paralysis is a serious effect where you will paralyze your turn will sometimes end before you can act. Yeah, um, basically you're paralyzed. Which isn't very great. Oh no. Which isn't good because it means Tiara can't attack for me. So we're gonna have to go with this. Let's go with the shooting star. No, flash. No, something star. We're about the same star. <laughs> Crap. Ooh. That little tiny thing just took up a lot of hell. Eventually, it will disappear by itself, though. And that's you gone. Remaining is one enemy the bird. The bird remains! No, the hell. But we won. We won before it could be that. He says burnt toast. 34 XP. 34 XP. Okay, so that's the two fairies that we've got now that we pulled out of the furies. Furies and fairies. That's a lot better. Okay, so. A part of a leg is revealed. <laughs> She's kind of silly. I was like sipping, sipping it. Sipping this woman. Okay. Um. Okay, so that's that done. Let's go to talk. Erin says, work harder. Tiara's the only one making an effort. You need to work harder too. How annoying. Being forced to do stuff isn't exactly motivating. Ah, jeez. Don't you have any spirit at all? Well, I did take a spirit to dump this morning. Did you really have to know that? <laughs> Tiara says, a tingly feeling. Dingly, dingly. Oh my. Are you impressed by how useful I am? Compared to you, thanks for nothing. You're messing with a sleeping lion. But this lion's got claws. So you better sleep with one eye open, you irritating bitch. <laughs> what a horrible thing to say. But ah, uh, it gives me such a warm, tingly feeling. So strange. <laughs> she likes a little abuse. It's weird. Let's go to a shop. Nothing new. Let's purchase. Can't roll really purchase anything currently. Um, we'll be fine for now. The pub. Talk. Nothing new. Okay, I guess it's just Fountain Plaza then. This is all that's left. Nothing new on this end. Okay, looking for Lola. Do we have enough money? I believe so. Hello. Hello. Give you what you need or what you want. It just depends on how much 
Do you want some Mario money? Blink, blink! That's kind of weird. Blink, blink! Okay, then we'll go marry money if you really want. Then you're older. But you do. Please do not interfere. I did not ask what you two want. Lola, feel free to ignore these people. Oh, poor Fang and Erin. 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 Then I shall take that one. So I recovered the cost. Well, we're not going to be going to the Catas Catacus Ice Cave just yet. Okay, nothing new there. There should be something new in here, actually. Yep, there it is. Catacus Ice. Um, are you going to the Catacus Ice Cave? It's a cave system in the full in the foothills of the Catacus Mountain Range, up far north of here. Obviously, it gets pretty cold there, which can affect your mobile ability. I highly suggest you take all the necessary precautions. Okay, so uh, a bunch of woolly stuff. Okay, so what I'm pretty much gonna do to end this part is we're gonna go over here. And we're gonna get a saw. I wanna be swords and stab it right in. Then pull it out. And that basically will reveal the third dungeon. But we're not gonna do that just yet. Okay, so um, we're gonna end this part right here. Um, so next time will be part 8, which will be the final part of session 2. Until then, bye bye.